Today I have a one brand review for you. The company Versed, which you can purchase products on their own website, or I found them at Target as well. They sent me over these products right here for complete free. No cost to me. I was so excited. <laughs> I don't get very much PR. And even better, they said no obligation to post a video, no obligation to post anywhere on social media. We just would like for you to try these out. <laughs> but they did give me, um, I think it's an affiliate code and also a discount for you all. Affiliate code means that I make a small commission if you purchase through the website using my code. That's what it means. And then I would use that to buy more sunscreen or skincare from them. But I will leave all that information down below as well as pop the code right here. Oh, hi, I'm Sean, Melanoma Mom. Welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave. Give this video a thumbs up. Over here on this channel, I talk about sunscreen and we chat about how to prevent skin cancer. And occasionally, I get the opportunity to try out a whole brand. And yes, I have a sunscreen. Let's start with that one first. I have tried this out before. This is why this one is unopened. I have a whole review about this one, and I actually used the other one that I had and put it on my face to test it out for you all. It's called the Guards Up Daily Mineral Sunscreen, 15.2% zinc oxide, which is fantastic. Has sea fennel and moringa seed extract and 2.5 fluid ounces. Please. <laughs> I'm gonna pop the price up here. But that's a great price point. You're getting more than the average sunscreen, which is usually around 1.7 fluid ounces. This is gonna last you for a while. The tint looks orange, which normally I would be scared of an orange tint but it shears out very nicely on my skin tone. I didn't look like an Oompa Loompa running around. My skin tone looked great. I would wear this on its own or under foundation. If you wanna see a complete review of this sunscreen, I will link the card right here for you to watch. Do I recommend this? Yes, I do. Now, to remove sunscreen, you all know I love a cleansing oil and I love some cleansing balm. Okay, I wore the sunscreen all day, did not make it outside, still feeling poopy. Um, I'm gonna put on this headband that Versed also sent me <laughs> and take off my, my watch. And we're gonna try the Versed Day Dissolve Cleansing Balm with Eucalyptus Oil and Vitamin E to wash off the sunscreen off my face. It smells like eucalyptus. Day Dissolve with Eucalyptus Oil and Vitamin E, 2.3 ounces, AM or PM. And I've only I only used a little bit. I only use this two days because it's not that it didn't work correctly. It did a fantastic job removing my makeup and my skincare, which is the most important part. Okay, I did use my regular cleanser after because I do like <laughs> um, to not have, you know, a kind of oily feel on my skin after I wash it, which, all cleansing balms feel the same to me on my face afterwards. It got the sunscreen off fantastic. I look forward to continuing using this for the rest of the week with a full face of makeup on <laughs> and see if it takes it all off, which I'm sure it will. It feels like it will. I'm not crazy about the scent. I'm not a big fan of the scent. It's not to my preference. It's a little more eucaly eucalyptus-y, is that a word? <laughs> <laughs> that I prefer. If you love that spa experience in your cleansing balm, I think you will really enjoy this. I love a toner, and I love a toner with witch hazel in it, which this one has. I just feel like it clarifies your skin more. I don't know, I just, I love a witch hazel in my toner. Daily Weekend Glow Daily Brightening Solution, and it is four fluid ounces. You get a lot. And it does, you saw, you saw me use the, the pump at the top. This does not dry your skin out. It doesn't leave a tight feeling afterwards. It just feels like healthy skin and preps your skin for any skincare uh, that you have coming next. I usually, after I cleanse my face in the morning, I start with a toner. This one is fantastic. Now, as you saw in the video, I'm not crazy about the pump, which, <laughs> It's just a preference. I like to pour mine in my hand and then pat it on with my face. Um, but if you like a cotton round to apply your toner, this is ideal. There's no mess. Um, so I love, 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 love this one. And then the last product is the Press Restart Gentle Retinol Serum with Bakuchulo. I don't know how to say that word. 
Bacuchiol. Bacuchiol. And encapsulated retinol, one fluid ounce. It's for aging skin, dullness, and problem skin. Use in the evening after cleansing. Use alone or between lighter serums and moisturizer. I have limited experience with retinols. <laughs> I try them and then they just don't stick in my routine. Um, I've also had the problem where if I use them too frequently, uh, it caused dry patches here. This did not dry out my skin and I think it's because it's such a mild and low percentage of retinol. This is a good starter one. It's more of like a thick gel. It's not watery at all. And you definitely, anytime you use a retinol, you want to use sunscreen. So see, it's kind of thick. It does have a slight scent. I can't tell if it's just the ingredients or if there's fragrance in this. So I want to look this one up. All right, so on their website, they say it's a non-scary and effective nightly treatment that reforms skin texture by softening lines and wrinkles and refines skin tone, evening out discoloration. I don't know how long you're supposed to use it to see to see results. So I have used this for two weeks and then I took a week off because I've been sick. Um, and so I'm going to start it up again. If you want like a an update on this, let me know because I plan on continuing to use this and see what it does for my skin. I forgot to press record. I am putting on the tightening mask, the clay mask. Um, we're supposed to leave it on for 15 minutes. So we'll do that and then we'll come wash it off. One to three times a week, gently exfoliates to help brighten skin. Red clay mask with turmeric, leaves your complexion looking energized. Vegan, cruelty free, fragrance free, dye free. All right, this is what the face mask looks like after 10 minutes. I am gonna rinse it off because I need to go to bed. This is a look, isn't it? This is a look. I do really like this. Can you wear this like out and about? Or is it only for washing your face? I'm not a headband girly. My face feels so smooth and soft after that face mask. That was very nice. I'm gonna follow with my toner and then I'm gonna put on just a moisturizer. I don't know if I'm gonna use this one or if I have another one, I feel like the clay mask might require me a little more moisture tonight, so maybe I'll use a, a different, more moisturizing moisturizer. Moisturizing, I'm tired. <laughs> I do like how soft my skin is though, wow. That's nice, okay, good night.